Hey, are you a salesperson, a business owner, entrepreneur, or just someone in business? Well, this video is for you. We're gonna show you how to leverage your time. We know during the day, you're gonna to talk to people that want more information, that want you to follow up later. Maybe it's a recruit that you're trying to talk to. Now, you always have your phone with you, and that means you always have your rep card with you. So we're gonna show you how to best leverage it. So follow along. If you're in a group setting, just go ahead and get everyone logged in. Take a minute. I'm gonna give you three seconds to pause this video to get everyone logged in so you can follow along. So I'll give you that three seconds starting right now. All right, now that everyone's logged in, hit the card editor button on the top left-hand corner and then you can hit edit profile. This is where you wanna add your profile picture. It could keep it fun, keep it professional. It doesn't really matter. Just make sure something's in there so people can connect with it. And then you wanna make sure your phone number, your email spelled correctly. And then at the bottom, add your calendar link. This could be Calendly, it could be HubSpot, whatever you're using for your calendar. And if you don't have one, no big deal. Just make sure you do that, hit save. And so I'll give you three seconds to pause the screen and get everyone to that point. All right, so now that your profile is dialed in, at the bottom middle, hit send card, and we're gonna send a test card right now. Let's say we send it to a guy named Mike Jordan, and we're gonna put in his phone number here. And then coming down, you can say this guy's a lead, this guy's a customer, he's a recruit, maybe you're out doing some recruiting, maybe he's just in your network, so you put him in under other. So let's say I keep him as a lead, you can see the initial message is changing, we'll go over that in a minute. You can add a text message campaign, you could turn on your social media profiles, you could swipe and add a cool video, maybe that your company's added or you've added, and then you can add different call to action buttons. So let's say it looks great, you're ready to send it, as easy as sending a text message. So it goes to iMessage and then I'm gonna hit send. So what I want you to do, I'm gonna give you three seconds to pause the video and I want you to send a card to the person to your right. And if you're on Zoom, just send it to someone on the screen or organize that and I'll give you three seconds here. All right, so you sent a card to someone to your right. Now they're gonna get a text message and they're gonna be able to click on your profile link and it's gonna take them, the homeowner or the person to your page where they can see your face, they can see your logo, your company name, all that good stuff. They can see all the videos that you sent to them. They can see all the buttons that you decided to, uh, to put in front of them, your bio, that's where they can read more about who you are. And then of course, they can see all the reviews about you. So the reviews are super powerful because your rep card profile will be with you forever where you can continue to generate reviews about yourself and about how you do business. So whoever sent you your card, go ahead and uh, open the link that they sent you and leave them a review. I'm gonna let you pause the video for the three seconds and that way you guys can leave a review or if you wanna send a referral, see how that works, you can do that right now. All right, so let's get back into the app now. So go into the app, hit card editor in the top left. I'm gonna show you a few other things. So the edit bio, pretty straightforward. Make sure you add emojis, tell people what you do outside of business, keep it fun. Um, that way that you're not just like a, a business or a salesperson to them, but you're a human being. Um, then here's the video library, guys. This is super, super, super powerful. If you get one thing out of this, this is the part, is that you can add personal videos and you can also add company videos. So if you're a company and you're working with different partnerships or different big organizations that maybe already have YouTube content, just go grab it and throw it in for all your guys. You do it in the back end panel and it'll apply to every rep, uh, you know, card on the, on, in the company, or you can add personal videos. Now, going over here to the call to actions, this is where you can add those buttons like we saw. Visit my website, text me, you can get creative. It can forward them to a certain URL. It can start a text message, start an email. It doesn't matter. You get to choose when you hit that little button down there at the bottom to add those. You can also change your default initial messages so you're not having to retype the same message over and over and over again. So take a minute and go update those. Um, your social media links, pretty straightforward. You can add your personal ones or as a company, you can add the company ones and then you can just uh, you know, block off everyone else from editing those so you can keep it very professional. Depends on how you wanna best leverage that. The edit uh, review thank you text. So when you get a four or five star review, there's not a better time than to ask for a referral. So rep card five minutes later after you get a four or five star review will automatically send a text asking for referrals. Here's your chance to edit what that text message says. And then if it's a one to three star, of course you wanna say, hey, thanks for the review. You know, How can I do better, blah, 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 blah. So that gives you that chance to do that. Now, I'm gonna rapid fire some other features. We're not gonna pause the video anymore. You're gonna just follow along. You can do all those edits right when this is over. So you remember when I sent the card to that person and then they opened the card, they watched my video. You can see that this person took time to click on the card, watch the video, visit my website. And I can be like, who was that Mike Jordan guy? 
boom, I click on it and it tells me everything I need to know right there about that person. Maybe I had made a note that said super interested or whatever and it could jog my memory of who it is that's clicking on my card. Now, if I go back to the dashboard, you'll also notice that Mike Jordan is now in my hot contacts. What that means is that Mike interacted with my card to a certain level and RepCard deemed it as a hot contact. So you wake up every day with like two, three, four, maybe 10 different hot contacts. And those are the best leads, customers, recruits that you need to talk to because they've interacted the most with your card. So leverage that. And then you've got things like reviews and referrals you can check on. You can also hit more and come over here and you can turn on your auto location. That means that when you send a card, it'll automatically grab the location of the person wherever you're standing. You can have uh, the ability to show caller ID. So you can see on my screen here that when someone calls you that's not in your phone book, it'll still show up as a random number, but it'll give you the rep card caller ID telling you who's calling. Now guys, there's a ton of other functionality, but this solves a lot of the day-to-day -day issues and makes things a lot simpler. So go in and edit your card, get those tweaks done, get videos on there, and we'll see you inside the app.